For me, uh, I grew up swimming. Uh, I kind of reached the point in my swimming career where I wasn't hitting times that I needed to do to help fulfill that Olympic dream. But I was pretty talented and other stuff just as an all-around athlete, and that's what you need for the sport of modern pentathlon, just to be able to um, do decent at a lot of events. With the sport of pentathlon, we have five different events, so there's a lot of stuff we're training for. We usually do six-hour training days, um, but luckily it's a lot of low impact, so I'm pretty healthy, or most of my athletic career I've been healthy, so no serious injuries, so I just keep doing what I'm doing and get ready for London. Uh, for me, I just kind of, we do um, our events throughout one day, and each event is individual, so I make sure I get up for that event, and then in between the rest time, I just kind of sit down, relax, kind of shut my brain off that way. I can just get up and go, because our competition days are 10 hours long. You want to make sure you're up and ready for each event. So anytime you have downtime, you want to just kind of take a little mental break, that way you can get yourself back up. For, I have a swimming background, so um, that's probably one of my stronger ones, and I've done pretty well in running, and everyone that kind of has um, my strengths and a little bit of weaknesses. Um, the cool thing with our sport is since we're burning four to 5,000 calories a day, there's no real limits on what we can eat. So if I go out and have pizza for dinner, there's no guilt whatsoever. If I have ice cream every once in a while, it's no problem. But I always make sure that I get all the vitamins and minerals that I need to help my body perform and make sure it's working 100% all the time. Uh, for me, ever since watching the 96 games, it was a dream of mine to step out there and, and have that happen. And you know, this summer I'll get to do it. And it just means a lot uh, for me when, I, when I'm out there competing, knowing that I have the support of everyone back home. And then also because I'm in the Army, even though it says USA on my chest, there'll be just you know, a special spot in my heart of all the, all the service members out there, everyone that puts on a uniform and serves their country, they'll be right there with me as well.